Oh god, I can't believe I was muted the whole time. And of course, my sound settings are fucked up again, so let me fix it really quick. There we go. Apply. There we go. All good. As I was saying, Venboy, welcome to the stream. Thank you for the hydrate and posture checks. How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome, welcome. Let's go. You bet. We are once again continuing our high adventures in Outward. How are you doing tonight? <laughs> Testing, one, two, three. Te oh, crap. My reactive PNG is not working either, huh? Um, where is... Has Avery's screen? Avery's screen must be scuffed, apparently. Some things just do not change, chat. They do not change. In fact, my chat box appears to have vanished as well. There you are. Put that there. Put this here. I have been slimed. I have been slimed. Why is my... Testing. One, two, three. Ah. All borked. Bork, bork, bork. We are unborked now. Completely and utterly unborked. <laughs> I've been hydrated and I have been slimed by yours truly. How are you doing tonight? In Aussie land, there's a slang and getting slimed means something more. Oh, really? Do you tell what it's like, what it means to be slimed in Down Under? I am very interested to know to add to my ever-growing database of human words. Oh, terms of service, I see. <laughs> well, even though we are a mature stream, let us go ahead and respect the terms of service as much as we can get away with. And we will continue in our adventures in Athward. When we last left Jialin, our character in Athward, um, I had fucking rage quit to the game because I couldn't find an NPC. Despite searching the wiki, I still cannot find this NPC, so we're going to do the next best thing. Happy ending? <laughs> Feels like everything's happy ending with you around. Alright. So... Alright. Cool. I think we might be able to play like this, chat. Now then. Rissa is supposed to be in this town. At least I thought she was. And I thought you would have the option to go talk with her to complete the que to complete the quest in a certain manner. It does not seem like that is the case. And despite searching online, I could not find a resolution to this problem. So instead of um, betraying everybody and telling the wrong people, we're going to tell the least dangerous person um, that I could possibly tell to complete this quest line. Because I sure as hell am not running all the way back to Serzo just to see if she's there, only find out she's not, and be unable to complete this stupid quest. Now, I could go there since, honestly, I need to go stop by Serzo anyway, but... I don't know, Chad. I don't think I want to. It appears I've somehow gotten myself stuck on this roof as well. We need to find a way to get down without getting ourselves killed. Do we do a little parkouring? We do a little, little bit, uh, a little bit, um, tomfoolery here. Now we just need to slowly fall into that pet barrel of pumpkins. Yep. Hey, we did it. 60 second plank, let's go. <laughs> Why stop at 60 seconds? Hmm. 
because the body says no more. <laughs> 60 seconds, but how many reps? You did three? One more to go. <laughs> yeah, baby, work those abs. Or had core, I should say. Core muscles. <laughs> hey there! <laughs> One of these days, I should play this game again and roleplay as a Kazite. As a Kazite. They look like a fun class. Look like they would be a fun class. Alright. Rissa is not here. I don't know where I would have to find her again, anyway. I mean, Berg, I guess. It's not that far away, so technically I could probably run to Shurzo and back and be fine. I'm just wondering if it's worth the trouble. Because she's supposed to be here, chat. Game and the music in this game is way too alive. Lift hard so we can play hard. <laughs> it is indeed extremely enthusiastic, to say the least. This game wants you to know, wants to let you wants you to know that it is hopping. All right. Let's go ahead and tell Math Matthias this information. Now, where is he? He's one of these people, isn't he? How can I help you? A chamberlain for the holy mission? Wait, what? By the scourge, I will call an immediate council meeting. This scandal must be handled swiftly and forcefully. Sorobor must answer for what they allowed to happen under their very noses. <laughs> I'm not sure what I can offer you for your... Ah, I recently received a gift of a piece of palladium. I can offer that plus 20 sil 25 silver as a reward for this evidence. Thank you for your aid. You've done the right thing, Jalen. The Holy Mission of a lot thanks you. <laughs> because I didn't feel bad. I felt bad about the other guy uh, planning on just sweeping it under your nose. Now then. What should we do next, chat? <laughs> I do know what class I would like to transition to in this game now. So what we're going to probably do is head to Zerzo. Talk to the uh, shaman there and become learn shamanic, shamanic resonance. Which has a lot of cool stuff, but the important thing that I'm getting it for is that it boosts all of my buff spells. So all these spells here I got here that increase my stats and whatnot, they get stronger and these things get a longer duration. It's going to be lit, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Alright. So what are we going to take with us back there?
the, bla the bra brass wolf backpack or the prospector backpack. Hmm. I think what I'm going to do is go ahead and start putting this stuff away, or putting putting these things away. I do have a home still in Serzo, so I can bring a bunch of this stuff home and put those there. Especially any swords I'm not using. I also want to take some of these parts home so I can transform them into into new tools of the trade. What here do I need? I'm keep the cooked alpha meat there. Jade Acolyte Boots. This is if you're a mage, though. And it costs you additional mana. Or it costs you... Makes you less, more prone to lightning damage for whatever reason. We'll be keeping the, using the elite desert stuff over there in the desert for obvious reasons. So what I think I'll do, I'll take home all of the stuff that I need to use for crafting. Leave the things I don't here. Could have sworn I had some assassin tongue on me on, on me. I wonder where I went. I wonder if you need round shield to make anything. So this requires assassin tongue. Saber and palladium. Fang shield needs a fang. One of these things. Gold lit shield. Just requires some firefly powder. I wonder if I can just buy the firefly powder around here. How can I help you? Are you selling any firefly powder? You're selling a phytosaur horn because I sold that to you. Or two bucks. This is a chef. So, probably nothing important there. How can I help you? And you have, do not have any fire. Oh, wait, you do have one thing of firefly powder. Cool. So, we'll go ahead and craft this really quick the golden shield. 18 lightning damage, 18 regular damage, 51 impact. Curious. It's also lighter than my crimson shield and does a fair amount of damage. I'll be putting it down there with the rest of my collection. I need to get around to healing a manticore later. Those live in the desert. Beast Golem scraps over here in Berg since there is somewhat a trader with there is someone over there that needs it. It's 
not even anything in the prospector backpack. So, what are we gonna put away? Suffering right now, gonna keep the plate home, scar home. Don't need that. Don't need these right now. Can keep the sapphire here as well, I suppose. Along with the copal. Always got to keep the gold with me. Because we're gonna be using that to make some purchases, chat. I'm fresh out of bandages. Like, completely. Completely out of bandages right now. Also just occurred to me that we're going armorless, which is dangerous. It's great for moving around really fast though. I'm kind of curious, why am I armorless? Did, was I planning on going back somewhere last game to pick up some stuff? Hmm. Hey Pastel, thank you for visiting. Thanks for the head pads. How you doing today? Did you see we got some new redeems that can be used with PNG now? Because that's totally a thing that's, that can be done now. Ah! Yes, thank you for throwing something at my face. That is exactly what I was talking about, you know. For real, for real. We're gonna be entering a cold zone, so I'll be needing some cold water. Oh, I got some cold water defense. Okay, cool. Elite hood only gives you... I'm gonna put this there. Gonna be going to a desert. We have to go to a desert from this location, so... Let's see if I can actually purchase a master hat. That would be very helpful. Running at the speed of light right now. I'm gonna talk to this worries me. Caravaner here. This worries me. Oh, there's actually a royal manticore that lives here. Interesting. I did not know that skin. Large emerald, some coral horns. Nothing here that I want. Very boring, actually. This worries me. Yes! I wonder if we should visit Harmata and see what it's like down there. Farewell, my friend. Farewell, my friend. From, let's do it one thing at a time, chat. We need to head back to Sirzo so we can learn some more skills. So that's what we'll focus on for now. 5.18 in the evening. I guess we'll be needing to go soon after all. I just realized that my guns are out of ammunition. Or are they? 
they are not. Let's go ahead and load this one, however, with shotgun rounds. There we go. Both guns are ready. My bow needs some repairs. Like a lot of repairs, actually. Eat some meat stew. Craft some bandages. By some, I mean as many bandages as I could possibly craft. Sell this recipe and we'll go to bed. How can I help you? How can I help you? Couple hours to repair and the rest to sleep. We thirst. We thirst, chat, we thirst. We can make it there in with this equipment, right? Maybe. I feel a little bit naked without wearing a helmet of some kind. Stop pissing around the bush. I'll keep I'll leave the beast comb scraps here though, because I do need that for a quest and it's much better to keep track of if I keep it here. This is about to spoil. Hell my brother the wild's starting to spoil too. Zerzo. Oh! Hey, check it out! They, Twitch has rolled out that whole thing where you can add as many t t tags as you like now. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's see now. Femboy. Non-binary. LGBT. Uh... VTuber, obviously. PNG tuber.
That's all I can think of right now, chat. I honestly don't know what else to write here. Eh, we'll start with this. Fuck it. Or... I'll probably do this. 18 plus. This tag contains invalid characters. Okay, we can't use that. Stream info update successfully. I, s I like the fact that you could just add your own tags now. Very pog. For those of you new to the stream, we are over here, and we need to get over here. Should be easy enough, but nothing's ever easy in outward or straightforward, for that matter. In the distance, I can already see bandits spawning in. They are T-posing. I rarely actually get to see that in action. Stream may seem relaxed now, but it will spice up soon enough. Some alpha deer over there. We will avoid them this time. I don't have any interest in finding them, especially not wearing this non-combat armor that I'm wearing. The main reason I'm even wearing this is so I could get to location location fairly fast. In fact, let's just go ahead and try and sprint all the way there, especially since we have eaten the food necessary for it, and we also drank a nice draught of water. As you can see there, my stamina recovery, stamina recovery is so high that it's barely, it's not even dropping fast enough, dropping faster than it can be recovered. So this is probably what Seth meant when he said that you could literally could just sprint from destination to destination. We are doing a goddamn marathon, is what we're doing. It is a very nice day, a uh, morning in Outward, over here in Enmerker Forest. The sun is only just now peeking over the horizon. I have to wa run around these ghosties because they are quite difficult to fight if you're not careful. I really don't feel like making an effort right now. Also, I don't have any decent armor on right now. So frankly, not the best idea. Ha, uh, isn't that beautiful chat? Look at that. Wish this game would save screenshots properly so I can get them and, you know, uh, share them online or something. Our destination is just over there, past the, past that uh, broken down tower. To relax in my chair a little bit more. There. Bree is bringing this uh, keyboard out here a bit. Here we go. Whew. Man, I hope I remember to bring rations with me, or we're not. Or we are not getting out anywhere. Really? Did I forget? Shit. We won't be able to get out of here without, ra without uh, rations, so I need to make some.
There we go. Three travel rations. That should be more than enough. And here we go. Ah, oh, good old Sherzo. How you doing? We'll head north. Go make a straight for the Cabal Wind Tower. And I am running out of food. I did not prepare very well on this trip today. Luckily, we got berries to eat. So not all is lost. Here's the lake. That's the Hollow Marsh. You can actually cut across here. Read this. Ooh. This is good. Unfortunately, it appears that we will have to fight after all, Chad. Oh no. Sucks to be you, buddy. Yep, his dog is dead, but it looks like the bandit himself has no interest in me. Well, unfortunately, I have a good inter large interest in him now. Insta killed. That was actually kind of that was actually kind of wild. <laughs> Very wild indeed. It's amazing how much I've grown since we're starting this game.
Oh yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. Goes past. Re return to the ghost pass. Ah. Oh, another power coil. It is hot as balls tonight for whatever reason. No idea what's going on there. I wonder if I can at least kill this ghost who's in my way, just to make sure he doesn't get any further in my way. Nah, I can just run past him. There's no need to fight. I mean, why bother? Where is pretty at here? Ah, mantis shrimp. Oh, man. That horror is just walking around outside here? I thought he was over behind the cage. Why is he out of his cage? Well, either way, I'm not ready to fight that thing, that's for damn sure. If we're careful, maybe it won't spot us. The game sure has given me a lot of traps too, but I don't think that I can possibly lay enough traps to kill one of those. Yeah, better not try it. Sounds like it's already fighting something too. Mantis shrimp thingy. Those things are weak to lightning, so if the mantis shrimp just uses lightning spells, they could have at least damaged it. Doesn't look like, doesn't look like that is what it was going to happen, though.
God, why is it so hot today? Ah, uh, we're back here. I appreciate that there's actually a kitchen here as well. Agatha the Maiden. How do you do? And so many potions for looting. But we are here for one reason and one reason only, chap. How are you? Well, several reasons. First off, let's go ahead and trade a, significant, a not insignificant amount of gold, silver, gold for silver. Thank you. That silver is very heavy. Good thing we're paying it to this guy, Mr. Albert. Excellent. Listen to me. And with today, we become a cable hermit, cabal hermit, also known as a shaman, also as known as. We are increasing our Jedi training. Now, the hard part is do I put the points in Sigil of Wind or do I put them in Infuse Wind? With Sigil of Wind, you can cast a lot of different spells. Turn your bullet into lightning and all kinds of other cool shit. You could even summon the lightning for that matter. Infused wind, however, makes you much makes me much faster and do more impact damage for three minutes. It's kinda of sad that I can't have both. Both would be good. However, Sigil Wind can literally call lightning down upon yourself, which would do a great deal of damage to people to boot. I'm gonna check really quick what spells this actually interacts with. Lightning spark, which causes a spark lightning explosion. Lightning Strike, which caused a large lightning explosion centered on you. And shooting with your bullets, which causes them to become lightning projectiles. And of course, using the Sigil of Wit, using Mana Push, I could fire Ethereal Bolts at people. Ah, uh, indecisions racking my brain, chat. As always happens. I 
think I'll get more out of Sigil Wind actually. Last but not least, let us go ahead and learn Conjuration. Very good. Very pog indeed. Sure cost me a pretty penny though. I'm down to 15 gold ingots. We will have to go on yet another journey to acquire acquire treasures. It's 11 in the morning. If we hurry, we could still make it back to town to Serzo itself. We are also 10 pounds over... What are we gonna do, chat? Let's head home. Let's try to avoid finding the horror as well. I'm not currently geared for that, that's for sure. Man, why am I so tired today? Do you think the horror can get me from all the way up here? Because clearly it can travel all the way down there. I wonder if I can even hit it from this distance. Honestly. What are even our hitboxes, am I right? Ah, uh, hell. Not this again. It appears the game has allowed me to get stuck, so I will have to debug myself out. There we go. I know it's stupid, but I really want to fight that horror and win, even though I know that I do not have the equipment necessary to fight it. At least I don't think I do. I could probably outrun it at this point. Maybe. I'm mostly skeptical about whether I have uh, quite enough tools with which to stake it through the heart. All these trip wires are burning a hole through my pocket, so... Is it fighting something right now? It appears to be confused. Well, that's interesting. Did 
Stupid fucking bird ruining one of my traps. The bane of my existence, chat. At least it's drawing, but at least it's drawing them away, the horror away from my immediate location. So it kind of worked out in the end. Kinda. Anytime you think you've had a have enough tripwire, you probably don't have enough tripwire. Honestly speaking. What I could really use right now are some pressure plate traps, if I'm being honest. Yeah, I can't help but feel like this is gonna not gonna turn out very well. <laughs> Where'd he go? It appears the horror has run off. I appear to be wrong. The horror is right there. Oh man, I'm running out of stamina way too quickly. Alright. Cool. Um. Okay, not cool. Hey. It's not going in towards the... Okay. Are you going to... Um, is it going to... It's not working. Oh, this was... Very bad. Chat, I did it. I finally killed one of the horrors. It only took several miles of a tripwire um shooting with two guns and uh using my special on him that was very anticlimactic i can't believe that actually worked 
I didn't even use the, uh, I didn't, wasn't even able to use the sigil of air correctly. Wow. Let's see, I didn't even need to, I didn't even need to cast any spooky magic on him after all. I will take this as a win. Your soul is mine. Oh, go, my god. We are being raided by Ari Exarch with a party of 14. Thank welcome, raiders. Welcome, welcome, welcome. My only regret is that y'all raided right after I did a most unexpected win against an enemy that's supposed to be able to kill me in, like, one hit. <laughs> Indeed, I am. And it appears that raid... Why is my... Thank you so much for the follow, Richard Games. Our Richard Loves Games. My name is Laura Hicks, and this is the Lowell's Time Show. I am a shitposter AI who likes to do variety games. Tonight we are playing Atward. Welcome to the stream. Uh, congratulations. That's the good stuff. Do you know of the raid m raid mod? Um, my I do have a bot here that is supposed to... I'm, I'm, actually, Nightbot is supposed to be doing that for me. Um, actually, oh, I'm, I'm done. I, now I know why it's not doing that. It's because I have to do it manually. I have to do shoutout REXR instead of raid. But I digress. Thank you so much for visiting. Welcome to the stream. What were you guys up to? What were you playing, Ari? <laughs> uh, it's an outward mod. Interesting. Call me RLG. Okay, I will call you RLG from now on. Welcome to the stream, RLG. And welcome to the stream, everyone else as well. You're playing Hunt Showdown. Oh, good choice. I haven't. You are stomping at Hunt. I'm glad to hear it. I'm not very good at hunt myself, so I'm glad to hear that you are. <laughs> Want some games, huh? Very good to hear. Lots of tasty dark western combat. Uh, nothing like uh, grim dark gun combat, am I right? Um, what kind? Of, what kind? Of, what, what kind of guns do you like running in? Do you prefer using in? Uh, do you prefer using in Hunt Showdown? <laughs> Uh, don't worry, I can't type for shit either. In the pines, where the sun don't ever shine. Seal, you were not late at all. Eh? I mean, I was actually late, so don't worry. Unfortunately, you did miss me get an epic win just now against this uh, very, very dead, very scary looking um, creature, which is now very dead. What's funny is, I'm not even wearing combat armor right now. I'm wearing a traitor garb, civilian clothes. Um, I just kind of wanted to try in my hand at killing this thing because you know me, I like putting myself in harm's way for absolutely no reason. And I even lined up having the spell set up and everything and then I tried to use the spell and it didn't work. So I just kept shooting it with my guns and then I used my sword special with it and it died. And I was like, oh, well, okay then, I win. <laughs> Uh, and while we're here, we might as well finish off this mantis shrimp that's just kind of, that has survived the horrors genocide. You really like the, you play a lot of bonus, but I really like the packs and usually a good rifle or shotgun. Big mood. I'll pre pretend I was there and say, woohoo, good job. Ow! Fuck. One second. Goddamn mantis shrimp. Ah! The tree saved me! Traitor garb is even better than combat armor. <laughs> I know, right? Uh, prefer to slate for shoddy sparks or Springfield. I love awkward combat. I want to do some play with playthrough with you someday, sometime. All right. Sounds like fun. As a cope for not being able to DS2. <laughs> uh oh, it already died. Probably from burning damage, I imagine. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of cooking while we're here. I'm feeling pretty good about myself, especially since we totally just... Oh, there it is. There's another one. Let's go ahead and... 
create some shotgun bullets really quick. And then we will think about facing this thing as well. Killing this thing as well. I'm surprised it hasn't noticed my presence yet. The AI in this game can be kind of funky sometimes, you know? Or maybe it's just role-playing as a confused person. It heard me say that, apparently. Yeah, as I was saying. <laughs> Salute, have fun, Lulz. I'm gonna go find a nom and stretch my legs, take care of those beans. I will do my best to take care of your beans for you. Thank you, your real human beans. Um, thank you so much for leaving them in my care, and you have a great night. Thank you once again for the raid. <laughs> I can't believe I'm actually still alive. Let's go ahead and heal up. Did I? Where's my water? I don't have any water. Shit. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and make camp, I guess. And then we'll go to bed and head back to Surzo. Store my stuff, prepare my next move, and then determine where we're gonna go next. Craft some weapons and items if I can. And then we are going to go head back to Levant. And continue our main plotline, questline. Ice is really good against those pistol shrimp. I'll keep that in mind. Ice Shadow is very good against pistol shrimp. <laughs> they just move towards you from a long range. Do you have the stealth passive? Um, I don't think I brought any stealth potions, stealth pots, or... Stealth equipment with me now. <laughs> Did I forget to bring my tent with me? Oh. Lulz, 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 lulz. Why do you do this to yourself? Change of plans. We're going to head back to the Hermit. Sell some of our junk. And then we'll head home. <laughs> I like to imagine that the reason they couldn't see me is because that particular shrimp was confused. Usually I'm pretty good about bringing all of my equipment with me. I don't know- Ow! Ow! Thank you for throwing something in my face. Um, I'm not sure why I forgot to bring something as important as, you know, a sleeping bag. There are hyenas there, chat. Oh, this night just gets better and better. However, I think I could take these things. Yep, but out! Thank you so much for the hydrate RTG and the posture check. Allow me to do that. Just or just do that really quick. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you for the head pad seal. <laughs> I typically have a 3D model actually. I'm using a PNG model right now because after trying to, my CPU is too old to effectively run Atbird and my Vroid model. It works, but then it has such terrible input delay that when I first started streaming this game, a lot of my deaths were from input delay. Spicer, very good idea. I will do that, assuming that they drop hides, of course. All right, then. There's only two of them. The problem is they can surround me, so I'm going to cheat a little bit and kill off at least one of them. All right. Now we're going to kill the other one the good old-fashioned way. I love this sword so much. It was worth all the time it took to build, to, uh... You make. Is that another mantis shrimp? Where the fuck did this one come from? 
just, they're just spawning out of nowhere, man. Jesus. Jesus, even. A thousand hours in this game? Wild. Alright. Be very, very quiet. We're hunting shrimp. Ha! Ah. Rock beats lightning. You're cursed with knowledge, huh? More like blessed with knowledge. Am I right? Did that miss? It did miss. What? And you're dead. Alright. Let's go ahead and... Loot the hyenas for their bodies. Make a sleeping roll. We're gonna go to sleep in relative safety up in the chamber in the uh, cabals in the shaman center, though. Thank you for the head pads. Oh, so you're gonna be turning in? All right, Spicer. Thank you for stopping by. If you would like to see more of my content, I do stream Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. I would really appreciate a follow. Otherwise, hope to see you again next time in another raid, maybe. Her pot turn punishes have rottened. I should have turned that into travel rations. Nighty night. What are we going to sell, chat? Honestly, I probably don't need to sell anything. I might be able to ma actually make it to Serzo like as I am right now. It's not that far away. Of course, this is me saying that has always has been largely the case for uh, Famous Last Words on several occasions, so you never know. Looks like my guns need some repair as well. Really need water as well, and like a fool, I did not bring any with me. I do have T's. The T's will need to hold me over. Eh. We'll just drink some water outside, chat. 
We'll boil it first, of course. I still can't believe I managed to kill that horror just now. Totally worth it, though. I wonder if I'm going to die of thirst. I still can't believe I managed to kill this dumb thing. Battle going over, going off the over there in the distance. Time for Brecky. Um, nom, 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 nom. I don't know why I just used that, but okay.
Ha! You missed. You missed again. You missed again. You missed again. I'm almost out of arrows, but chap. But it's okay. They're dead. Blue sand. They've just been slaying birds left and right, haven't they? Thought, bitch. I'm carrying way too, way too much crap right on me, chap. Way too much. Dit dit. Dit dit. It just occurred to me, I have to go through the ghost pass. And if I have to do that, I don't think I'm just going to be able to walk through that. We'll need to either kill, we'll need to fight our way through or sprint through. That could be a problem. Make an attempt, though. <sighs> there shall be an attempt. Can't you still throw your way through the area? Oh, uh, why do I keep pushing that button by mistake? The area that you go through is actually quite narrow. So even if I, if I were to stealth, I don't think I can just walk past them. Their vision range is, fair, is not that short. Case in point, that's where I have to go. It'd probably be better if I could just fight and kill that skeleton. And I think the skeleton has recognized where I am. Yep. I might be able to just... Hmm. Okay. I can just shoot them to death, I guess. That works too, right? Thank you. Crafting these guns to use in case of an emergency was the best idea ever. But sometimes I worry that I rely on them a little too much. Cool heads prevail, though. This is dev truly outward as a game where if you prepare for everything, you are most likely to succeed. If you don't, you will be restarting the same area several times.
My pickaxe is busted right now. Oh, fuck my life. Really? Okay. Oh. I could just do that. Let's see if this works, chat. Ah, uh, there's no soul for them to reveal, I guess. That would have been very useful. Ha! You burned to death. Sucks to be you. Now then, reveal soul, please. I guess it only works on bandits. Or other humans. Winter, how are you doing tonight? Welcome to the stream. You're doing well? I'm glad to hear it. I'm glad that you're doing well. <laughs> I'm doing well-ish. Had kind of a large dinner, so I'm kind of sluggish right now. You are a well? Well, 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 well. What do we have here? <laughs> More self-care? Perhaps. I am fairly sleepy, so I'm not even sure how long we're going to go tonight. We'll see in about an hour and a half from now, I guess. Oh, thank you for the head pat. I'm not sure if you were here, but um, I got some redeems working for my PNG form. If you want to test those out. People seem to enjoy them. Ow! Uh, look at an ickle fickle bandit here. That's just chilling. He's about to get his ass handed to him. As I was saying, bro, he didn't even stand a chance. Damn. <laughs> However, I am, I am pretty much injured, so I will need to do something about that. Just casually making our way home, outward from the fortress. I gotta say, this Master Trader garb looks great on me. Maybe I could- maybe I don't necessarily need armor in this game if I just learn to get good. And learn- and use the power of guns. 
an enemy at my side. <laughs> oh, that was beautiful. That was totally worth it. We are here. We need to get over there. It's a beautiful day in Adverb chat. Nary a snow in sight. I am carrying way too much, though. I need to drop all this stuff or sell it. Maybe both. I know, right? Don't they? This per giant purple mountain. I gotta dump some of this stuff. It's been a while since we've been home. Something I hope to change fairly soon. It wasn't so hard now, was it? Still took a fair amount of damage, though. Ah, the air conditioning is kicking in. We got too much junk, chap. We gotta dump this stuff. We gotta turn it into just uh, turn it into things.
Way too much garbage. Bird. Brain. Ah, raw more meat. What a beautiful day. Would be a bad time to get ganked by bandits right about now. I can't believe there are mods for this game too.
Almost home, chat. Who goes there? We are being raided by Kaiju Channel. How are you today, Kaiju? <laughs> it looks seen. Welcome to the stream as well. How you doing? Thank you so much for the raid. We are playing some Outward tonight. That's what I do every Wednesday, in fact. <laughs> I've, you're, you've been chilling? I've been good. Ah! Who goes there? Thank you so much for the follow, it looks seen. Welcome, welcome, welcome. You're now officially a lully. Welcome to the Lulz Time Show with your host, Lawler Hicks, a shitposter AI who escaped from not 4chan and is now currently stuck on Twitch and is forcing a human to play video games beyond their will. I mean, see what? <laughs> I'm actually fairly sleepy today. I had a fairly large dinner. Struggling to not fall into a food coma. We usually play really, we usually play outward for like four or five hours, but I'm struggling to stay awake to even two hours. What I had, took my dad to this uh, Mexican place we got down here that got visited by Guy Fieri. Yes, that Guy Fieri. Had one of them, I forgot what the full name of it was but in Spanish, but it's basically this uh, slow cooked um, pork. It's basically this uh, slow cooked um, pork that has been cooked in this uh, in this uh, verde sauce, extremely tender to the point where giving me a knife was kind of pointless. I just tore it apart with my fork. It's so tender, it makes barbecue, it puts barbecue to shame. Very good stuff. And of course, you know, Mexican food always comes with like the red beans and rice and the Mexican rice and salad. So, oh my god, one second. Oh, there's two of you. I see how it is. I'm gonna go all industrial revolution on your ass. Using guns. And I'm out of ammunition. Ah, oh, shit. Man, I am not dying today to you bastards. I am literally just a few clicks away from my from home. Not today, buddy. Idiot falling for my counter attack. Uh, what was I saying? Sounds like Chili Verde. Yes, I think that's what it. That's what it's supposed to be. <laughs> my bad. Uh, Chili Verde. So it was um, pork and a Chili Verde sauce with red beans and rice. Um, salad that had some grilled cactus in it, and also some Mexican rice. Good stuff. It's a good thing that games like this have. Battle music. If it didn't, I wouldn't have known that I was about to get ganked by two hyenas until just just then. You love Mexican food? Very based. <laughs> so, Kaiju, what were you guys uh, playing for your stream? <laughs> Home is just around that corner. You can't see it because it is kind of still early, but you'll see at a certain distance, you'll actually see my lighthouse rotating in the distance. <laughs> oh, no problem. I tried to make it a habit of uh, at least shouting out people that are reading my channel. It's just polite, you know. Usually my streams are a little bit more active than this. Part of the reason why it's a little bit slow right now is because I'm trying to get home with a pack full of stuff. In games like these, I have a bad tendency to loot everything that I see and find and it's not nailed down, which has some obvious, some um, unfortunate results. But uh, you could see town right over there. You could see the Palisade walls. We're gonna make ourselves in, head, crawl to my lighthouse, Take a big nap in game, of course. 
and then plan our next move. Honestly, I'm surprised I got as far as I did wearing such light armor. This is not even armor, really. This is Master Trader clothing. Great for running around very fast and carrying a lot of garbage with you. Not so good for combat. I love this sword, too. This gold glitch claimer was definitely worth all the time it took just to craft. I'm also low-key glad that I crafted these guns. In case of an emergency, indeed, but... Ah, I need iron scrap. The sun sets in the horizon. Feels good, man. Almost there. Almost there. Finally. Oh man, I thought I would never get home. Or one of my homes. So I have two homes in this game right now. When you beat the main quest line, you get more than one. Chat, remember when we used to live over there? Underneath the roof of this house, just squatting? I remember those days. sleepy. It's so early too. Or at least my definition of early. Chat, why am I so tired? <laughs> I have half a mind to pop some to pop some caffeine pills right now to stay to uh, be a little more energetic. through the doors get you through the doors so tired we dodge rolled straight into the door itself chat what's up with that <laughs> It's 
been forever since I've seen this stuff. to bed it's because I didn't go to sleep very early very early last night after all. I guess we could just make it short and sweet this so this Wednesday. Come back renewed on Friday. Assuming Deus Ex doesn't crash again on Friday. I'm starting to think that it really is just a problem with the game's optimization. It's really screwy and likes to freeze despite being such an old game. Because as you can see here, I'm not having any problem. Then again, I do try to use my V-Road model with ASX on Fridays, so who knows. I'm so sorry. I'm really sleepy today. Instead of trying to force y'all to, to put y'all through me trying to stay awake, we're going to cut stream a little bit shorter tonight than usual. We will continue next fr next Wednesday, and I promise I will get some proper rest so I can stay awake and be my proper energetic self. We will go ahead and find someone to raid tonight in the meanwhile. Share the love and all that good stuff. Who is up this evening? Actually, you know what? Mai is probably still streaming. She started streaming around the same hours that I do now. 9 o'clock on Monday, on Monday and Friday. So we might as well send y'all to her to her unless I'm wrong of course seems like everyone's streaming on Wednesday now dang everyone is streaming tonight that probably explains all the uh raids too oh thank you for the head pats uh pastel thank you oh that's strange uh, Mai is not streaming right now. Hmm. Did she end early? It's only 11. Alright. We'll send you to someone else then. We will send y'all to... Ah, we haven't raided Living Zombie Night in a long time. She was one of the first people to start raiding me back in, way back when I started VTubing. They recently started VTubing, or got back into VTubing themselves after a long hiatus, so let's go ahead and pay them a visit. Our raid message tonight will be... Sleepy Raid with lowercase levers to represent why I am ending the stream a little bit earlier today. If you don't have access to our headband emotes, feel free to use the emote of your choice. Thank you. And if you would like to see more of my content, hopefully when I'm a little bit more awake and a little bit more energetic, I will be streaming again on Friday. From 9 p.m. Central Standard Time to 12 midnight, and I'll be streaming Guilty Gear Strive on Saturday from 8 in the morning to 11 in the morning. Feel free to drop me a follow. Hope to see y'all then, and have a good night.
Hey, yo, thank you, Lost Time, for the seven, for the seven raiders. That's awesome. Sleepy Raid. Hi. Um, 